boys and girls, today we are drawing Lily from Lily's Purple Plastic Purse. It's not gonna look exactly like the character in the book and yours might look a lot different than mine and that's okay. You wanna make sure you try to take up a lot of space. You want her head about this much but you wanna leave room for her body and her legs. So I'm gonna start about right here on my paper. I'm gonna draw her head and make a rounded triangle. Come all together like that. And then I'm gonna give her big ears. I'm gonna start about right here, out and around. And I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. Mine aren't exactly the same. And then let's go on the inside and do that on each side. She also wears a crown in the story, so I am going to get her a crown. You can also choose, if you want, to add some more details, some fun details to do her movie star sunglasses that she wears. She wears a blue dress with some polka dots on it. So I am going to start about right here. And I'm going to come down and make another sort of like a triangle. And I'm going to attach these together just like that. And I'm going to come down a little right there. Okay. Next, I'm going to give her an arm to hold her purple plastic purse. I'm going to draw out like this and this. And I'm going to give her sleeve of her dress. Okay, and I'm just going to, I'm not going to do her hand on this side. I'm just going to have the purse. To make it simple for myself, I'm just going to go and make the shape of her purse. You can make it however you would like. I'm just gonna kind of make it like this. I'm gonna bring the arm down a little, and then just like this. If I'm going too fast for you, you could always pause and then come back when you have finished and go step by step. Okay, so there's her purple plastic purse. On this side, I'm gonna kind of have her waving. So I'm gonna go up and up with her arm. Do the same thing for her dress sleeve. I'm gonna give her a little hand. Draw her thumb and each of her fingers. And come down. Okay, if you want to give her her tail, and you can kind of go like this at the end. And she also has a ribbon, a bow on her tail. So you can make a triangle out like that and connect it to make the triangle and do the same thing on the other side. And connect. And there you have that. Okay, and the last thing, so I'm gonna give her her legs and her cowboy boots. So I'm gonna do that. this. Okay, so I'm going to come down just a little out, just a little bit. And then I'm going to make two humps. One, two. And I'm going to come down, but not all the way. Go out like this and connect. I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. Come down. My two humps down there. and then she had stars on her red boots. So if you want to, you can also add the star on each one. 
Okay, and you have your lily. The other thing, if we look, you wanna add, she also has a cape on on this page. So if you want to add the cape, okay, what you wanna do, come down like this on each side. You're gonna make that. Maybe two of those. Okay, and then about right here on her head, you're gonna come out like that. I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side and see how her hands are here. So I'm just gonna go like that, stop, and come into her body over here, like this, and this. And now she has her red cape. Okay, and that is it for Miss Lily. You can color, if you wanna color to make it look like Lily. I have this one I did, which is different. It was her movie star sunglasses. I colored her to look like the story. I did the chain, like Mr. Slinger's chain and her dress. Okay, I would love to see yours. You can send me a picture or put on Facebook in the comments. Thanks for tuning in. Bye.